Welcome to the second part of this series about uh, my linear actuators, which I'm going to use for lifting my heavy CNC so that I can move it easily in and out from where it is stored. In this part I will show the control box I designed, which is based on uh, four relays. I will use four relays because the current is just too high for uh, two of them to control all the four linear actuators. Uh, so I simply need to use four and also because I have these relays in my box so it's, it's no big deal to use four of them. The relays I will be using are uh, similar to this one, but they are of course 12 volt relays. They are very small uh, and will easily fit in the box. I will install everything in. The circuit is really very simple, just uh, polarity switching. So it could be easily replaced with uh, just uh, switch with on off on positions but I don't have uh, a switch and I have uh, several relays so I will be using this relays for this simple function I will be using four relays because uh, of the high current uh, required for all the four linear actuators to work at the same time. Each relay can only handle 90 watts, so that's that's not enough for the four actuators. Uh, I will divide the four relays so that each pair handles uh, one side of the CNC. So this way uh, I figure that uh, a pair of uh, these relays will be able to handle two actuators uh, without overloading the relay. I don't have an exact data of the current consumption of, of the linear actuators, so I can't really calculate the need, but uh, I figure that uh, it's going to be quite high. The direction of the movement is controlled by this on-off-on on switch, which will allow me to change direction or stop the movement if I want to. I will also add three LEDs, one green, one blue and one red to indicate the power on and the direction of the movement. This completes the electrical part of the design, except that this must be doubled since the drawing only shows two relays. And as I said, I will be using four. The other two relays are of course connected in parallel with these two.
Thank you for watching and uh, welcome back next time. I hope you will visit me again uh, to see part 3 of this uh, series uh, where I will show the actual use and how it is installed on my machine. Thank you and welcome back next time.